Des Rocksteady, King of the Pit TV, signing in. Venus is the title of this one. We're listening to Marquee Moon by Television. How, how many views did that last one have? 548k. This is 535k. Let's go. That was a good tune. That was a good tune. Um, I didn't think it was as good as... The, I don't know. I, You know what? I'm not going to say it was worse or better than the first tune because there were two different energies and they were both good. They were both creative. Um, very much so in the guitar line. Very unique guitar lines. You don't really hear stuff like that. Um, you know, that guitar work is unique. It's, it's unique. Um, that lead guitarist, uh, well, essentially the... I wouldn't necessarily even call it a lead guitar, but the Boulder guitar, um, well, let's be fair, yeah, let's call it a lead guitar, um, generally speaking, that's the case. Um, they have a real good way of creating these melodic hooks uh, that just repeat and repeat, and as opposed to like riffing or 
um, you know, just playing a chord progression and so forth. They've got this jangling, like, broken chord progression. And um, it really works. It, it, it was really good. The drumming was unique. Um, when, when we started beating on the toms for a moment, um, the lyrical content was good. I took a moment to sort of listen to the vocals which you know I, I know most people would do so but i'm a guitarist first and foremost so i listened to the instrumental prior to um really uh paying close attention to the vocal line and just allow that to sort of go on and um the vocal was um unique in a poetic sense in a yeah it was good because it worked but it wasn't just write a song by numbers um, you know, style of writing, and he definitely pulled it off. That was really good. We got Friction coming up next, track numero three. Okay, let's keep going. Making music. Oh, 